back to another My Day and Toys video. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be doing something that I thought about just the other day, and I mentioned it in yesterday's video, so I appreciate you guys that let me know that you wanted to see this video. If you're a pick fetter or a stop motion artist or you run your own figure feds or whatever the case is, man, and you really want to build a roster, but you don't know really where to start, or maybe you're trying to build a roster or a small collection of figures on a budget, today, guys, I'm going to let you know like a small little roster you guys could possibly build. I'm trying to keep the range of the budget in like $200 or less. I feel like $200 is pretty good. I think you'd be shocked at what all you can get for $200 as far as like WWE Elite figures. Now, obviously, if you were trying to build up a small little collection and you didn't want to go break the bank entirely, for $50 bucks or $100, bucks, you could probably go out and buy... You could buy some Elites, but the most bang for your buck would probably be to go make a roster full of basics, but this is only for like Elites. I'm trying to make a roster built off of Elites. These are some of my rules here. Only Elites or Ultimates. I highly doubt that's the case, but only only elite slash unrivaled collection, you know, I'm trying to, you know, we may have some AEW in here, but basically we're going to be building a small pick fed roster using a budget of $200. We may go just over 200. We're going to be using various websites and stuff like that to go through and see if we can build this roster up and see what comes of it. So let's go ahead and dive in. Now in this video, I'm not including the ring. I'm not including the championships. I'm not including other things that you might need. You could of course build those things out of cardboard or tape or other things like you can get really invasive and in inventive and creative guys if you get your wwe elite boxes you can tape those together you can use vhs tapes as the barricade you can use a crowd backdrop that you print off from office depot i mean there's so many different things to pick fetting and being creative i mean that's probably the most important thing when doing so is just being creative having fun with it creating your own sense of things the reason i created my pick fed the way i did is because i wanted everything custom made and i did everything to make that happen titles microphones money in the bank i wanted everything to be custom made so you guys can do the same things you can draw your logo goes you could free i mean there's so many different things you could do man but this is excluding the ring this is excluding those accessories and things like that it can add up pretty fast i just had a vision that i wanted to stick with but let's get to building this roster man and let's start off with the main event scene now the first name i have guys is going to be aj styles aj styles is a really great figure and a great main event talent to fit right in there because he's super cheap if you go to ebay guys and you go to and you type in aj styles elite and you go up to there's a little icon if you click that and you click low first it'll bring up the lowest priced item and put it near the top and it may take a little searching you know you may have to do a little bit of searching and things like that and it may not be the exact AJ Styles you want every single time but here I have two AJ Styles elites one is for $12.74 with a best offer he may accept $10 if you ask $10 but you got one for $12.74 and then you have another one for $7 with $5 shipping so about $13 bucks for the AJ Styles elite very great deal right there a main event talent great figures. It is the Elite 51, but what are we saying? Now, honestly, you may get lucky sometimes, and if you look up a certain superstar and you sort it, you may find an auction that you could possibly win on eBay, but if there's no auctions and you just want to go click the buy it now, there's a little thing on the left-hand column. If you click buy now, it'll pull up all the things that are not auctions, and it'll sort it out better so you don't have to go through the auctions and everything else like that, but my next guy is going to be Seth freaking Rollins. Another great talent. Could put him in the mid card. Could put him in the main event card. You can even put have been the tag team division if you wanted to but there's actually a limited time deal right now on amazon prime where a seth rollins elite the fan takeover version is going for 17 dollars flat and that is a fantastic deal for that figure that's that's freaking excellent right there so for 17 dollars man i'm taking my seth rollins elite right there the fan takeover that is perfect that is beautiful that is what we like to see that's two great main eventers right there that's a wrestlemania level main event for your pick fed stars we're going with seth rollins fan takeover elite next up guys we're going with my man finn Bat and just like Seth Rollins, he's actually on Amazon right now for $16. And that is another fantastic price for an amazing figure. I also found one on eBay, I think, for an auction that was like $5 with 11, 11 hours left. So again, man, if you get on eBay and you look up WWE Elite and then you, you can actually use that little tab that we talked about and you can put it on Ending Soonest. If you click Ending Soonest, it may give you an opportunity for an auction that's ending in a few hours and you can snipe some of these elites for really, really cheap. That's another hack right there for shopping online for WWE action figures. They did have the top talents version with the rainbow gear that had a little bit of paint chipping on it for around $16 on eBay, but I feel like the Elite 82, it's brand new, it's going to come shipped, and it is an updated Finn Balor. It looks better. It's got the shooter hands, you know, Balor Club t-shirt and stuff. I don't think we can go wrong with that Balor Club or that, that Finn Balor right there. We're going we're to go with that one. Alright, man, we have three main events slash mid-card talents, depending on how you want to look at it, already for great prices. Now, if we keep this up, another the guy that 
that I think should be really cheap, guys, is going to be Drew McIntyre. Main event talent, really good figures, really good likeness on those figures. The only thing is, is what you really want to look out for is the top talents kind of, of, of players. You know what I'm saying? The guys that have top talents elite, they kind of rot on shelves that sometimes go down in price. Check your big lots. Sometimes you could get some good figures there as well. AJ Styles, Finn Balor, Drew McIntyre, Seth Rollins, Roman Reigns, even, you know, those top picks guys are the guys that are going to be left on shelves. There's multiple figures of them out there and you can get them for very cheap sometimes. All right, guys, another fantastic deal. Survivor Series Elite Drew McIntyre with the Raw t-shirt. It isn't in the updated skin tone, but it's $14.99 on eBay. That's a fantastic price. You may even be able to get it cheaper on ringside. Let me look up ringside real quick just to be sure. Sometimes it is nice to check different, check different websites, compare and contrast your prices. Okay, so they actually have the Elite 83 Drew McIntyre for $14.99 and the top picks for $14.99. Let's see if I could bundle the Elite 83 Drew McIntyre here with some other figures and see if we can get a really good deal here. All right, but regardless of the fact, I'm going to put down Drew McIntyre $14.99. Whether you spend it on eBay or whether you spend it on ringside, it's going to be $14.99. I feel like if we got it on ringside, we could probably pair it with some different stuff, get some cheaper things, and get a better deal overall. So I'm going to add that to cart and we'll check back later on. Another one that I feel like you could get pretty cheap, guys, is going to be the Fiend Bray Wyatt. Now, he's got a few different figures, but I'm going to grow with the top picks 2021. I think that's the cheapest one right now. And it runs for about 16 bucks. Another great talent that you could throw in the main event card. Doesn't have to be around a title belt. You can get creative with him as well. So I'm going to put him down as well. All right, right now, guys, we are at $77 on those five talents right there. AJ Styles, Seth Rollins, Finn Balor, Drew McIntyre, and The Fiend for 77 bucks. Not bad at all for five elites of those calibers again. But now we got to get into some mid-card talents, and then we got to get some tag teams. But we have a little bit, I mean, we have some pretty, we have a pretty good amount of money to work with. We have about a buck thirty to work with. So let's see what we can come up with. A guy who has really good figures but really cheap is Sheamus. So what I've done is I looked up eBay. I looked up I looked up Sheamus Elite on eBay and I found one for eight dollars with four dollars shipping. That is going to be about roughly I mean I guess thirteen dollars if you want to say that. But they also have the brand new Elite eighty four on Amazon if you have Prime or sixteen. So whichever one you want to go with. If you don't have a Prime account, you can go with the one on eBay. It is isn't the better figure, but not bad at all right there. That brings our total up to $90 at the moment. However, we got to get some more mid cards. Now, I know a guy that is very, very cheap is going to be Shinsuke Nakamura. Shinsuke Nakamura is a great main event talent, and he could be put in a tag team with somebody, and he could be a main event star. And this is one of the best deals that you're going to find right here, man. The Elite 81 Shinsuke for about $12, bucks, $11, $12 on eBay. Fantastic price. How are you going to beat that? I mean, that that's, that's a freaking money deal right there, man. That's that's insanity. So $11 for Shinsuke Nakamura Elite that has interchangeable hands. He's got a good attire on. That is unbelievable. That's 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 probably the deal of the day right now. I don't know how you're going to beat that. It's literally like $12 shipped to the door. $11, $12, bucks, very cheap figure. And a lot of his figures are cheap, so you could just kind of pick your own one. But I feel like that's probably the best deal we can get right there. More bang for your buck. Next up, guys, we have John Morrison, another great talent that you can get for pretty cheap. We can add this to, we can add this to our ringside collectibles order. You guys remember the ringside collectibles order that we had with the Sheamus? If we add the John Morrison to the cart, he's only $14.99. Again, another guy you can pair in a tag team. Another guy that could be in his own on the mid card. That's another important thing when you're building this. What is, what is this? When you're building a pick fed roster and you're trying to cut some corners, save a little bit of money, finding those guys that can do either or and can play multiple roles in your pick fed is genius. And I think one last talent that's actually good on Amazon. You may or may not want to plug this guy in, and you may be able to find some other talent that works good, but Buddy Murphy would be a really good guy to get. He's about 18 shipped on eBay. I mean, on Amazon, I'm sorry. And on eBay, he kind of goes for the $20 range, so he may not be one, one guy that you could probably make work. But one thing you literally could do on eBay is literally go to the search bar, type in WWE Elite, use that little toolbar that I told you about, and sort it by shipping and lowest price and then just scroll and you'll find auctions you'll find random people trying to just ship it now again if you don't want to do the auctions you can go down there click buy it now and it'll give you the different like you can sort it by buying format you can do all listings accept offers buy now i'm gonna click buy now just to see what comes up or you don't even have to be as broad as wwe elite if you'll just type in a certain superstar kevin owens elite hit sort flip it bam elite 43 kevin owens for 11 dollars. look at that right there for 
freaking fantastic. And if you didn't want that one specifically, okay, even better. $12.50 for the Chase Variant Elite 66 Kevin Owens. Look at that. So I'm going to take Buddy Murphy out and I'm going to put Kevin Owens right here for $13. bucks. All right, so that is what we have right now. As it stands, our roster is AJ Styles, Seth Rollins, Finn Balor, Drew McIntyre, The Fiend, Sheamus, Kevin Owens, Shinsuke Nakamura, and John Morrison. And we've only spent $129 so far. But that's a really excellent way to find really cheap figures, man. Like, this works for anybody. It doesn't have to be these guys, but you could literally type in Sami Zayn Elite. Sort it by lowest price or whatever. Boom. Sami Zayn Elite. $9 with $4 shipping. That's $13. So again, just play around with that a little bit. Type in any, any guy you want. Chris Jericho, Heath Slater, Bobby Lashley, whatever the superstar's name is, Elite in the eBay column. Sort it by lowest price plus shipping, and it should give you the best deal right there, and it'll probably range anywhere from 10 to 18 depending on the figure, obviously, and the character, but that is a great way to save your money. Now, as far as our tag teams are concerned, that is where it gets a little bit tricky, but a great tag team would be the New Day. If you go to New Day Elite, type in New Day Elite, I scroll a little bit, and you're probably going to find, like, a nice little mix match of New Day figures that somebody's trying to sell two of them. Okay, here it is. Biggie and Kofi, they're not in matching gear, but $28. $28 for two figures, and it's a tag team. So Kofi and Biggie are coming over, now we have one of our tag teams for $28. Bucks. That will go into the thing, and that will give us $157 bucks right now, and we only have one tag team, which kind of sucks, but again, you can pair that with some other people and make other tag teams if you wanted to. Now, going back to what I said about the Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens thing, that's another tag team right there. If you want to grab both of those guys, we got what? Both of those we could have gotten for $12 or $13 a piece. And that would give you literally $26 bucks for a tag team. That's probably what we may have to do for the rest of our tag team division because I think we only have about $44 or something like that. Let's see if we can get two more tag teams in here in our budget. It may go a little bit over budget, but let's see what we can come up with. I'm trying to think of some guys. Let's just see. I, I mean, I don't know. Let's see if we can get a Miz Elite. I don't know if that'll even be possible, but looking up Miz Elite. Okay, he actually has a Miz Elite right now for $12.50. That's fantastic. So we can get the Miz in here for $12. He could go with John Morrison if you wanted to make a tag team out of those guys. All right, guys, for our last little tag team that I think I'm going to find here, I went on to ringside, and all I can really think is either getting the package deal of the Viking Raiders for $33.99 or the Street Profits at $33.99. Just depends on which ones you guys want. But if you went with one of those tag teams, it would be around $34, bucks, which would put our official total price tag, not including all the shipping and the taxes and stuff like that, would be around $203. If you threw in the shipping and the taxes, it would probably be closer to the $210, $215 range. But that's not a bad thing. If you want to hear the roster, let's go. Here's the total roster that we came up for for $203. Again, you could shift some stuff around. You could probably, you may even be able to add more people to your roster if we would have done the method about looking up a superstar's name with Elite and then trying to come up with, you know, what to fit in right there. And again, pairing different guys. Like if we picked up Sami Zayn, he could go with Kevin Owens. You could not go after the Viking Raiders or the New Day and you could literally just type in random superstars and pair them together and probably get even cheaper figures. But as our roster stands, we have AJ Styles, Seth Rollins, Finn Balor, Drew McIntyre, The Fiend, Sheamus, Kevin Owens, Shinsuke Nakamura, John Morrison, The Miz, New Day, and The Viking Raiders. That's 14 total figures for $203, and that gives us a, su a substantial main event card. You could take three or four of those guys, put them in the main event scene. You could take the rest of them, put them in the mid card, and you have two solid tag teams, and you could even throw in a third team, and by the time that you uh, got your first few shows going, by that time you may have a little bit more money. You could add some superstars. You may go to retail, find a random superstar that your parents may want to get for you. I don't know. There's a there's a lot of different elements that go there, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Anyway, not a bad roster whatsoever, and I uh, hope you guys learned a few things about shopping online and the way that I would find guys. Again, going on eBay, typing in so-and-so elite, you know, Kofi Kingston elite, and then, you know, sorting it or whoever you want. Specifically, that is the best way to do so. But anyways, guys, that is pretty much going to wrap up today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy. Let me know what you think of my roster or if you guys could build a better roster or whatever the case is down in the comment section below, man. Let me know down in the comment section. I would really appreciate it, but I'm getting out of here, guys. This video took longer than I expected, but yeah, thank you guys so very much for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter and TikTok at MyDamnToys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't cross the line. You cross